So, it has been a very fun month for videos. I have been doing a eBay repair challenge with my mate Vince, also known as Vince, Steve from Tronix Fix, and then Paul from Tampa Tech. Basically, we have bought some items off of eBay, repaired them, or at least tried, and then sold them. The idea was that we had a $200 budget, which is about 180 quid sort of thing. So then we had to buy a specific set of items to fit into a sort of category for each week of the month, and then sell it all on eBay again and see if we can make any profit. So I have the results. It's quite exciting. Drum roll, please. So item number one was the Super Mario clock. This thing didn't actually have many problems. It just needed a huge clean and I had to clean the contacts of the buttons with some IPA. That cost me 22 pounds and 75 pence. I sold it for a total of 28 pounds and 50 pence which is a total profit of £5.75. Item number two was the Tomy Dingbot. I bought that for £7.90. Couldn't get that to work. I sold it for £7. That is a loss of 90 pence. Item number three was the PS Vita. This thing cost me 20 pounds. It needed a replacement screen and then a massive clean because it was horribly dirty. The replacement screen was 18 pounds. That means I spent a total of 38 pounds and I sold that for 53 pounds 50, which is a total profit of 15 pounds and 50 pence. Item number four was the smoking robot, which had absolutely nothing wrong with it. I bought it for 15 pounds. And then I didn't sell it. It just wouldn't sell. I've still got it. So that thing was a, a massive fail. So that's a loss of 15 quid. Finally, Buzz Lightyear. Buzz Lightyear cost me 20 pounds. I had to repair his mechanism for his wings to open. That thing I managed to sell for 35 pounds, which was a 15 pound profit. So the whole thing was 103 pounds spent. Gattis, would you like to come and do the honors and read out the profit made? 20 pounds and 35 pence. Oh God. And you know what makes it even worse, right? I live in Jersey. So when I ship to the UK, I have to prepay the VAT. So I would have had to, have, I would have lost another 20% of all of that, which is, I don't know, four, four pounds. I'm not very good at maths. So another four pounds. So that brings it down to like 15 quid. Plus I've got to post them all. That would have exceeded 15 pounds. So I lost money. I hope you guys have enjoyed the eBay repair challenge. Thanks everyone for having me on. Uh, go and check out their channels in the description below. If you did enjoy it, please subscribe. Yeah, hopefully I'll be asked to join the next one. One final thing that I wanted to talk about is there's been some conspiracy that I have been lying throughout this eBay repair challenge and making up the prices and Photoshopping and all of this stuff, which is absolutely crazy. No one's getting anything. No one who wins this wins anything. We're not exactly gonna be winning like respect, like yes, they made the most amount of money. It's just a bit of fun. It's, that is all it is. It was some friends getting together on YouTube and just having a laugh. I didn't even repair toys, never repaired a toy in my life. I just, you know, gave it a go. It was a bit of fun. I lost the money. So obviously it was just, you know, the entertainment purposes. Okay, there is the argument I was going to make a bit of money back on the videos, but nowhere near the time spent. Um, these things took a long, long time. So it does suck that I have managed to attract some controversy throughout this because for the most part of my time on YouTube, I have sailed through with absolutely no problems whatsoever. But to those people who have, I have upset, I am sorry, this isn't a lie. Maybe on the listings which were over a certain age and you couldn't open up the full listing, maybe there was a couple more pounds of postage which I didn't include, but okay, if I add another five quid onto the whole thing, I still lost. It doesn't really make any difference whatsoever. Hope you guys have enjoyed. Sorry to have to address this, but it's just one of those things. Catch you guys in the next video. Peace. <laughs> 20 pounds. <laughs>